Oh hey, didn't see you there. I'm Robin. Did you know dumplings were actually used for medicine? Oh hey, Brian, the external vice president here. Did you know that Dr. Zhang Zhongqing actually created the dumplings as a remedy for frostbite? And nowadays, dumplings are consumed traditionally during Lunar New Year, aka the Spring Festival. Alright, so the things you'll need for dumplings are cabbages, green onions, pork, or meat substitute like mushrooms, and... Last but not least, dumpling wrappers. Hi, I'm Rachel, ACA's cultural chair. Let's get cooking! So you're gonna grab all your ingredients, put them into one bowl, and once you got all of them together, you can start mixing it. Right now, Rachel has got her lettuce, green onions, ginger, and garlic with their pork. You don't necessarily need a pork or a meat, so you can use a meat substitute such as mushrooms, you know? Shiitake mushrooms I heard are hot on the market. You should check them out. Right here we have Rachel going in at the dumpling meat. It's really good. She's a natural. Look at her go. Apparently, you can't mix the pork too much or else something happens like it can't gets a little mushy I don't know. Uh, Rachel just said not to mix it too much so we listen to the master chef next we got seasoning salt and pepper thumbs up hello kitty soy sauce Wow now don't be shy put some more there you go now you got sesame oil pretty cool here we go plating the dumpling meat into the dumpling grab a teaspoon and then put it into the dumpling next you get your finger get a little wet put around the edge of that dumpling do not get that dumpling meat wet here we have rachel demonstrating like a master look at her go one plate two plate Ooh, out of focus three plates beautiful she is the dumpling master the dumpling shifu the dumpling of oh happy accidents no one saw that it's okay uh and this is a tip you can push the dumpling meat inside further just kind of like squish it all and make it tight helps ever keep it all intact and really good and tasty yeah look at that beautiful dumpling and into the frying pan or just a pan put some oil smack your dumplings in there let it cook for a little bit until they're kind of golden at the bottom next you want to put some water this helps it steam and cook entirely we didn't have a pot like a cover so we used aluminum foil and guess what it works just check it out look at that oh the steam delicious here we go plating so yeah that was how we make dumplings i hope you enjoy this is VoiceOver Anson signing off. Bye-bye. Here are our dumplings. Thank you for watching the video, and we'll see you at Dumpling.